هاي ذا كونسبشن اوف ذا امتينس يوزد از ا سينونيم اوف نوثينجنس بات ات كونتينز ا تايم اند بليس also the fields of electromagnetic and gravity i think we have to start our thinking not from the mass and stability as newton's theory doing but from the emptiness and the movement using einstein's theory of general relativity we cannot measure the time or the place without moving Movement is the intermediate factor between time and the place, but our movement affect our measuring of the time and the place. So, according to Einstein theory, if we move very fast, the time and the place are going to contract till we reach the speed of light c, which equal about to three hundred thousand kilometer per second then our time and the place become absent in that absolute speed the time and the place become totally united in the speed of light itself which look like the original form of the united time and place that compose the emptiness as a mixture of united time and place in the absolute speed c the light moves by the emptiness speed which is still absolute anyway it is not the speed of light it is the speed of the railway speed of the emptiness which light connect to it Light is existence connected to the speed of the emptiness. Mass is existence connected with the stability of emptiness. Hmm? So the light moves by the emptiness speed, which is still absolute anyway. The mass which we belong to stay together, grabbing each other and connecting to the emptiness but do not move by its speed. Mass composed also from the essential movement, but do not move by it. We cannot sense this absolute movement because it composes us. It is separated from the mass, which has another level of movement in itself, suppose the space and time, but the destruction of the mass produced by our also related with C as equation of Einstein, energy E equal M C C hmm? that's mean mass multiply by light speed and multiply by light speed so we from stability can measure time the time or place separately via the movement standard straight speed or round speed but as much as we move the separation become less and the measurements contract till we reach the shape of united time and place. In the movement itself, see the absolute speed of the primary existence, the emptiness. In that primary existence, emptiness, there is a state of exchanging time in place and vice versa as a crossed circles of whirls movements the same relation between electric and magnetic fields 
and in the moment angular rotation same relation hmm. so as you see we try to know to know the emptiness via our knowledge of existence but we cannot understand or test the emptiness in laboratory hmm? so it must be virtual it must be done by minds hmm? every concept we we mention here we will explain later but we have to start from a point point by point hmm? so we use the vector vector hmm, to represent the linear velocity as a magnitude speed s by absolute value without the direction place changing by time amount of place changed by time and add to it the direction in this way or this way same speed in this way or this. so that the direction hmm, which must be stable by time because we define the linear speed the linear velocity this is defining the linear velocity we use our conception about time and the place to describe the events of speed as it above but time and the place are united by prior primary form previous to our conception hmm? the absolute movement c which we name it emptiness in that essential movement the magnitude s hmm, is stable as a tangent speed and the direction of it hmm, the direction of velocity is changing so i prefer to write it in this form c not vector it is vector of rotation c tangent is absolute but its direction change its direction change so according to its direction direction it changes and to its speed we can define the radius so if if the time go faster that means that the place will contract if the time became low the place will expand so that is the relation between time and the place which uh, represent the Kibler two row of uh, the conservative conservative of the area of the part of the uh, circle hmm? so the time place is C as absolute hmm? time place is C in absolute which equal delta place hmm, which is c and delta direction which is w so delta place multiplied by delta direction that means delta place multiplied by delta time hmm. time in the continuous changing in direction angular speed w and the place is its radius r so c tangent equal r multiply by w time and place 
R X is changed to conserve the speed say in its absolute value. So the radius go faster, go uh, up and down according to the changing of time of the emptiness. Hmm? But the speed, the tangent speed, conservative. From stability of newtons, the angle is not unit. If we say angle, it's not unit. Hmm? Degree, that's not unit. We cal when we calculate, say it is not, 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 unit. not meter, not second, not joule, not, nothing. This is from the newton's angle. No mean to direction in this way or this way. Because from stability, we start from stability. But from movement, also, especially in high speed, the distance became the transition. Distance means transition, not mean thing stable. Hmm? Hmm? Distance means I am here after second or third second, I will be there. So, distance mean transmission. Now, between two points in defined speed and time. Changing of speed, if we changing the speed, mean acceleration. Hmm? So, so, if the acceleration is changing the value of the speed by time, also may changing the direction of the velocity. So, changing the direction of velocity and changing the magnitude of speed, that means acceleration, which is m on square second. That makes the difference between the newtons and the quantum mechanics. The direction of our measuring, clockwise or counterclockwise, So, <laughs> what's the difference between the difference between the mechanics quantum and the Newton quantum? Mechanics quantum start from movement. Newton start from stability. The angle is not unit in Newton, but the angle is unit meter on second in quantum. So, also, if we uh, calculate by clockwise, it's different from if we calculate counterclockwise, because in this way, we intervene in our measuring. We intervene in our measuring. We choose this direction or this direction, so we are part of our measuring. Hmm? That is make the secret of the uh, 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 quantums and the probability of the quantums and so in this way we start to understand the relation and why we go to the emptiness to unify to unify our knowledge of existence continue